Good morning. I'm actually a lifty. But I know how to do both of my hands. Thank you. Good morning. I did come on a little later just to get everybody time. Yeah, I want to start doing hard gel. I mainly only do acrylic. Well, I prefer acrylic. I can do poly gel, but that's about it. Good morning, Chris. I'm using some Dream Nail Supply. This is called Pearl. I think it's called Pearl. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's called Pearl. What did you win it on, Chris?
y'all i am not a pro at doing duck nails so just bear with me it is a little hot so i am working with wetter beads just so it won't dry up as quickly I want to try to do more poly gel, but um, I'm just not going to buy any. You know, I got plenty of acrylic, so there's no need to waste money. But I've tried poly gel before, but I mean, like, actually consistently do it or use it in times of that. This is not the best application, but um, it's okay. One thing I definitely want to get into is like build a gel, hard gels and stuff like that. Things outside of like poly gel. <clears throat> Good morning, PJ. Well, afternoon for you. But it's only 1116 over here. I actually really only do one hand. This my own um, dominant hand stays dead. And I keep that on, but my right hand is for content purposes. So I technically do not wear my sets. This is a pop off. Um, you know, life of a content creator. So in order to keep the content going. Oh right, right. You were in um San Antonio, I think. So. It's still 11. I forgot. I forgot. I'm thinking about somebody else. Y'all, not too much on the nails. They is a little on the thicker side. But it's okay. This is nothing but a pop off. I've been on three days in a row, y'all. <clears throat> so that is something new. And I'm surprised. I might come on tomorrow, too. It'll probably be early in the morning. No promises, though. I'm starting to get the hang of this. It's actually fun. Yeah, I really only do pop-off, especially since content creator. I can't keep my nails on. Well, I can, but it means it just won't be... Um, consistent content. And for anyone coming in, hey, good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are. And if you're watching the replay, hey. All right. I'm done with application. Now I'm gonna clean my brush. If you're just not coming in here, I use Dream Nail Supply Pearl. How does pop out method work? Um, it's basically like you do the method, whatever one you choose, 
And once you get on your set, you can pop the nails off and go about your day. Um, the um the method I use is um I put a layer of peel off base, a thin layer of peel off base first, and then like I use the Madame Glam peel off base, and then I go in with a thin layer of matte top coat. That's it. And if you ever miss a live, you can go back on my channel, click live, and you can watch the replays. Um, I usually, the lives are not that long. It doesn't really take me long to do nails. I think yesterday nails took a good 45 to 50 minutes, less than an hour to do. And they were some 3XL. So, yeah. It usually only take me long if I'm running my mouth most of the time. For anyone that's asking, this is what my nails look like. And we got a little dangle. I did these last night, a couple hours ago. I used cuticle oil and matte top coat. Yep, yep. Yeah, I want to try um, heart gel. And also, like the builder in the bottle. I want to get into that too. Sorry, y'all. I need a new phone stand, anyways, because I lost the screw and part of it was like messed up. One thing about me, I am not finna keep buying new things. I'll just work with the nails, the hand, the stain. It'll be all right. I can go without it. So what do you mean? You put taco on your nails and then kick it, or then you just apply on top of whatever you want to have a link to it. So what you would do, say if I didn't have no nails on, it's just my bare hands. Um, what you would do is, what I do is I use peel off base coat. So I put that on my natural nails, a very thin layer. I cure that for 60 seconds. And then I go in with some matte top coat, cure that for a full 60 seconds. And then you apply your tilts, hard gel or whatever you're using, tilts, foils, dual foils, whatever it is. And you just go about your application, you just apply it on top. Um, I don't, well, I think in my very first live, I was showing y'all my pop-up method. You'll have to go back and look. It wasn't my last live. I think it was my very first live I ever did where I have my own um, pop-up method on there. But for the most part, it's very, very simple. Hold on, y'all. I'm trying to get a what's the name. Do I have IG Moon? What's that? Oh, never mind. You talking to somebody else? I think my very first live I did, I showed my Papa method. So if you want to watch that, and I also can do a video, it just probably won't be anytime soon. Or I might try to make one a day and post it, just a real short video. And I'll tag you so you can see it. Just once this live, hold on. Once this live is over, um, just comment down below so I can re remember to do it.
Hold on, I gotta be able to see y'all while I'm doing my nails. What's a good idea? What did I say? I don't even remember what I said. Oh, okay. Yeah, tag her in the vid. Yeah, it'll be easier for her to find it too. So I should make sure. Um, who was it? Moon Child. Make sure you just once it's live over, or just comment on any one of my videos right now, and I'll make sure to tag you so I can remember. And what I'll do, I'll probably once I get off live, I'll probably make a quick little video. Um showing you and i'll tag you maybe i'll do a short so it won't have to be a you know full video but whatever i'll just make sure i'll tag you and if you missed it and you're just not coming in hey everyone um i'm doing a cute little duck set very very simple i use some duck tips um off of amazon i do not recommend them only because they run very, very small. Good morning, Marcy. Yes, three days in a row. I might come on tomorrow, too. But you'll probably be in bed. Dep depending on what time I get up tomorrow, um, I'll probably come live. I only came live a little later just to give y'all some time to, you know, roll over out the bed. And also, I had to go to the um, post office, to the library, and stuff like that. So... Yes, PJ. I'm going to show her different methods um to do it. Don't worry. I'm going to give her, like, each hand, each little finger, I'll probably show, like, different methods on how to do um pop-off. What am I doing? So it won't just be my own pop-off. It'll be all the variations of what she can do and what she can use. And it's all because not everything works for everyone. So I'll definitely show her about three to four different um methods of how to do pop-off because... People, sometimes people do cuticle oil and top coat. For me, that works a little bit, but it's a little painful to remove. So yeah, what I'm gonna do, yeah, I got time after the live. Cause we're not gonna be on here long anyways. Cause this is a very short set. And all I'm doing, I'm gonna be using some blooming gel and putting colors on top, making a nice cute design. That's it. I really want to do something simple today because most of my videos were live. They've been a little extra. I also want to give the girls who are more simple a couple of looks. You know, for the more, majority of everything, I do freestyle these nail sets. Good morning, Jonah. Wait, good afternoon, Jonah, because I know, I think you're an hour ahead. Like, don't get me wrong. Ain't nothing wrong with somebody going to be basic or whatever, but don't come for people that likes extra nails. Good morning, Miss Jeannie. I noticed you said you push your live back. I'm gonna try to be there, depending on the time. Cause I was up way. Cause I was like, should I go live? No, nah, I'm gonna watch Miss Jean. Cause usually when I'm on live and you hop on live, I have my phone popped up. So while I'm on live, I'm watching you also doing like three billion things at one time. But for the most part, yeah, I just be silent watching. But I'll be there. Yeah. 
Yeah, no problem. I'm always, let me tell you, I'm always looking to learn something. So I'll definitely be going into people's lives, especially people like you who are more, much more educational and actually teach and give tips and stuff like that. I'm liking the how-to lives and you demonstrating different things. It's okay if you don't have pill-off base coat on moon. I'm going to show you different ways. You know, it's multiple ways to do it. What drill am I using? Um, It's from Amazon. But... It's not. It's probably a dupe for my cart, but it's not a my cart drill. Um, it looks like this. It's on Amazon. I put stickers on it myself. I'll link it just to remind me. Put a little comment about the drill. Remind me, cause I'll be forgetting. Plus, it's a lot of work filling out your description box. Even though I, I always do it, but sometimes I forget to add a couple things what I say in the live. So just leave a comment. But I'll probably remember the um at the drill i was supposed to do the last time i forgot i remember you asked before i got it off amazon no did i no i didn't get it off yes i did well you can find this drill literally on aliexpress amazon but what the thing is i think i saw it on aliexpress first and it was like 73 bucks but i was like oh, i'm not paying that much so i went on amazon looked up the same colorway and it was like a $30 difference and it was on sale or something like that. I've had this drill probably like, I don't remember how many years, two and a half. Yeah, these ducks are really, really wide. I did want them tapered in a little bit, but it's okay. I am not stressing about them. They look good. These look like the OG duck nails, not the newer version everybody's doing with the little tapered in duckies. I like mine wide, but not too wide to where they clash my fingers. I know duck nails is not everybody a cup of tea, but let's just be respectful and not too much. You know, because some people be like very, very rude about things like you worrying about somebody else's hands. You worry about somebody else's hand, but you ain't the one wearing them and stuff. Yeah, I literally just did my left hand um last night. Not even 12 hours ago. I think I finished at like 1 o'clock or something. I'm going to show you my... Hold on, let me finish filing and I'll show you my left hand real quick. I know somebody asked me, I can't remember, um, do I do videos on my left hand? Yes, but technically, oh crap, technically no. Only because a lot of times I be out of frame and I like to get good angles. And plus when I'm doing my non dumb the hand, I like to be up close and personal. Hold on, this drill is dragging. Hold on, what? Has it gave you any issue within those two years? Um, no. This drill, actually, I've charged this drill up probably every once, every two months. Um, I don't drop my drill or mistreat it. So, this drill has lasted pretty long. Two years is a long time. It's actually been two and a half years. So, almost three. So, this drill has been held up pretty strong. Um, that's the one thing about me. Hope I'm not missing any comments, y'all. Sorry if I reply late. And if I don't see it, y'all, just comment it again. But I do pretty good at keeping up with the comments. And if anyone, like, just coming in or missed it or you're watching a replay... And missed it. Also, I use Dream Nail Supply Pearl on my nails. Y'all already know. My favorite. 
Now my application was a little rough, but that's to be expected. <laughs> I could have did way better, but I wasn't really thinking. It is a little hot in here. That's why I was moving a little too fast because I don't like being hot when I'm doing my nails. I got my fan on a little bit, but I didn't want it like towards me because y'all probably wouldn't hear me very, very good. It's a little, it's a little hot today. Um, the weather is so crazy though because it was actually storming last night it was very very gloomy this morning and now it's only 11 36 and the sun's like beaming now Yeah, PJ, the South be going through with the weather for real. Oh, crap. And I don't know if y'all missed it or not. Um, I'm just going to be doing a very, very basic set. I'm going to be using some blooming gel. And if you don't have blooming gel, you can use base coat, top coat, any type of, what you call it, like clear gel or whatever to do this blooming effect. Like, I think two days ago, we was on a tornado watch. But then, ain't nothing happened. And I don't know where the sun was shining like it was July or something. Like, you can tell very much so that summer is fastly approaching. Because it's starting to heat up. Crap, sorry. trying to be very very careful y'all because the cuticle area is very very thin and if I file too hard it'll pop off like right, one thing about me I did do the cuticle area a little thinner than I would normally do only because these are pop off and I ain't want to waste my own my pearl one thing about me I don't like wasting good acrylic especially from a brand that's high quality that I like. And if, it's, if it was from a brand that I didn't too much care for, I'll be wasting it. Or using more too, more than enough product than usual. Sorry if I'm out of frame, y'all. I'm just trying to shape. My nails are a little longer, so I'll keep hitting the camera. But for the most part, I think I'm in frame. So how's everybody day been going so far? Anybody at work? Do anybody homeschool? Or is y'all on y'all break watching me? What do you find a long duct tooth and how they can sell long directly? What grid you use? I only use the 8080 grid file from Dynamic Nail Supply. Um, I do not recommend these duct tips only because they um run the sizes run very, very small. They are from Amazon, but I've seen a lot. These are the regular size, I guess. They didn't say extra long or anything. They just said duct tip. But I've seen some pretty decent ones on Sheen, AliExpress, and Timu. So check them out. But with the ones I got from Amazon, do have some too. But the ones I picked, I prefer not to recommend because I don't like them. So if I don't like some, I'm not going to recommend it. Although you might like it. I just prefer not to say, oh, yeah, get this because I don't like it 100%. I'm in frame. Okay, thank you. I just had to make sure. So, did I already answer this? What grit file? Yeah, 8080. I'm at home getting ready for the doctor's appointment. Oh, yeah. All right, so that's look good to me.
Oh, okay. Homeschool. I always wanted to know how it is when you homeschool your kids. Do y'all think it's better than going to a traditional school or like a private school or whatever? For me, probably so. Because you get more learning experience in. For acrylics, only shaping, I use 8080. Now, if you're doing poly gel, which is um a much so um softer, what you call it, um whatever the word is, it's like acrylic. When it dries, it's hard. It's like the hardest form out of all the medium. So 8080, 100 is good too, but 8080. Less filing and it's easier to get your shape that you need. Um, like poly gel, you can get away with doing 180, not 180, yeah, 180 or 100, but it's minimum to no filing with poly gel. Like, you mess up a little bit, you can over file easily. I do not even like, I like Timu. Wait, is it Timu or is it Sheen? I think it's Timu. I do not like shopping on Timu. Because I remember one time I was missing an item out of my package. And I told them. And they was like, show proof that you didn't receive. How am I supposed to show you proof of something I don't have? Send you a picture of my bad hand? Like, what? Yeah, 100 and 180 files do the same thing but they'll take a little longer to um shape your nails especially if you're not the best at application one thing i'll say don't worry about filing focus on your application it'll save you a lot of time and money on files What did I do with that buffer? Do y'all see it? Am I tripping? What did I do with it? I literally just had that buffer. Did I just buff my nails or am I slow? Did I just buff my nails, y'all? Confused. I don't know. Well, accepted into program. They have six videos for thirty dollars worth of pro thirty dollars worth of videos. I I was drugs overcoming. How do y'all get accepted into the old things? Oh, I did buff. I thought so, because I was like, where'd that buffer go? I probably threw it in the trash. That's why I couldn't find it. Over here wasting time. Thank you, John. I'm over here tripping, so I can put this up now. Like, how do y'all get into the program? I'm talking about team only, not any other thing. I see a lot of... I love that they work with small um, micro um, creators or whatever. All right, have a good day. We'll see you later, and I'll try to make sure I get that video out for you. Like, what do y'all do to get a self? Because that'll probably save me a lot of money and time, especially when I want to re-up on products like buffers, files, and nail tips. I think that's cool. So it's like a win-win. You put Timu affiliate on the search bar and just, it's a link to it. And you just sign up and that's it. Just apply, okay.
All right, y'all, give me a sec. I'm going to get some gel polishes so we can do the nail design. I'll be right back. So don't comment anything until I get back. All right, I'm back. <laughs> All right, so do y'all have a link? Anybody can send me a, the link? Yeah, most of these polishes are from Matter Glam. I'm going to go through the colors real quick just in case you want to recreate a look. But you really don't have to use the same exact colors as me. Just, you know, find something similar. So we got Bright Barbie Neon. Maddie. Perfect Pink. Glectra. Um, you have Sublime. And these two are hip nails. I got these a long time ago. Yep. You type in T-Man Spoons and then click on join. I had a bad experience, but you'll have a good one. Gorgeous polishes. Okay. Like, what happened, dude? Like, how many videos, like, say if you have, like, a $30 budget, how many videos is that that you have to produce or, like, how did that work? Okay, thank you, Miss Jeannie. I appreciate it. All right, y'all. I finally found the palette that I was looking for last live or whatever. It was on the floor underneath my desk. But, yeah. I think I forgot to show y'all. Here's what my nails look like. They're a little dusty because I just got through fouling. But, yeah. And I got a little dangle. They cute. The Karomi. I love Karomi, y'all. And these are little spinnies. Six videos. Two YouTube and four shorts. Okay, that's not even a lot. If it's four shorts, you can do shorts. Real, real simple. Two videos? Baby, I'll give them two ten-minute videos, two five-minute videos and call it a day. They are a little dusty, y'all, but that's because I've been filing I messed up the spinny thing because I glued them shut. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, I don't even need a lot of polish. But I need a little bit more than that. Let me tell y'all, I don't mind wasting my polish because I'm the only one using them for real, for real. So I do add more than needed. Yeah, and I like purple too. So I try not to overdo it with purple. Which is weird because a lot of my nail sets. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. I use green a lot. A lot of people think green is my favorite color, but nope. Yeah, I used a lot of um, B Glitter products on these nails. I wish I would have did a video, but usually um, I do my nails late at night, especially my dumb hand or whatever. Bray, how is school going? I've already graduated um, 
fall of 2023. Are you talking about like for nail? Are you talking about like for nails or whatever? Or are you talking about just basic school? I haven't started school for nails yet. I'm going to be postponing that. Only because I'm transitioning over. Like moving wise. Oh, thank you, John. So, yeah, I have two degrees, basically. I just did something on... What am I talking about? I'm thinking about something. What, what are we talking about? What am I talking about? I don't even remember. Yeah, this blue is from Madam Glam. You probably got it. But if you don't, ask them about it. It's called Maddie. Y'all, don't be afraid to reach out to y'all reps and ask them for certain things. Yeah, Marcy, that's good. What did you go for, if you don't mind? Um, to about the one I just finished. Um, I got my associates in science degree. Um, that's basically two years, but I finished it in a year. So it just basically um, prepares you to be like a RN, you know, anything that's certified in the hospital, um, hospital fields or what is it called, um, whatever. I'm I'm over here thinking. I'm reading the comments and getting sidetracked. But with nails. I've changed the school and you know when you're moving and things that's different I want to be closer to the school that I'm thinking about going to and also I don't like doing pay like payment plans I like to pay everything I don't like to feel like I owe anybody anything so what I am going to start doing you know since y'all on live I'll spill it I'm just going to be starting like a doing custom press-ons and pre-made press-ons for everybody at first i started off doing um only local locally but i'll start doing it for everybody and they're only going to be like custom press-ons where you see me like a picture or something they'll only be like 35 dollars real cheap any size length shape whatever it doesn't matter and for my own like pre-made press on the ones i do and they already ready shipped and ready to go they'll just be twenty dollars so something very suit um short simple and easy my daughters are going to college in the spring they graduate high school in june wait when do they start going to school if they graduate in june do they go in september or something Cause usually the well, down here is May when they graduate, not June. So when do they go back to school? Now, when I do these custom press songs, it is gonna be a limit because I don't want to overly buy charms and stuff. Like if I don't have something on hand, I am gonna have to decline your your set, or you can just pick some um, alternately. One thing about me, I don't want to spend unnecessary money just to make one customer happy you know because if i say if i buy, if you want a specific charm and what if it don't come in on time or it's like I only use it once now i'm stuck with it so yeah that's something new yet scary but i think it's gonna be good and also i don't know how to do like the sizings or whatever y'all know what i'm talking about Yeah, I know some people send out sizing kits. I think that's too much. And by the time you re you get the sizing kit and you give it, send it back to me, I think that's um like wasting time, especially if you need press on like on hand real quick. Y'all know what I'm saying? 
Normally school starts in August, but they're just changing to early August. Oh, okay. Sounds good, Kira. How do I raise my channel views? We usually do graduation in May, early June. They turn back. And all. Yeah. Um. Yeah, usually like graduates like May 20 or something around that time. They start back up in early August. I've never heard of anybody do graduation in June. So that's cool. Wait, how many kids are that's graduating this year, Jonah? That's amazing. I'm looking for something. What am I looking for? Dot and tools, dot and tools. Mm -hmm. You can get kits or coin method. What's that? What is a kit or a coin method? Are we talk what are we talking about? Am I slow or something? Oh, never mind. Press on. Yeah, I am slow. Cause what, what? What do you mean? Yeah, I'll probably do the um, like the coin method. That'll be super easy. Um, it'll save you a lot of time. And like, if you want to do those, what you call it? The little. I just said the word. The little kits, the sizing kits. I think that'll take too long, especially say it's somebody in like freaking or north or something. I don't want you to be waiting too long to do it. Two girls, six. Ooh, 16, 18. Okay. That's good. <laughs> yeah, I probably prefer the coin method. When doing custom press on now, pre made press ons, what I'm gonna do is probably give you like it's gonna be like a 20 piece, so more than likely you're gonna have one the correct size, you know what I'm saying? The coin method is basically you get a coin, like somebody takes a picture, oh, hold on, somebody takes a picture and has place a coin down and you place it down. So when you receive the picture, all you have to do is get you a coin, place it on your screen, and zoom in to the um, shape of the size of that coin and then you can basically like lay your tips out and show it that way I hope I explained that right I'm not good at explaining things but I'm good at showing better than I can um, tell you know what I'm saying I think I use too much Did I explain that good enough? Did you get it, Marcy? Like, is that... Did I explain it right for y'all? Okay, okay. Thank you, thank you. All right, hold on, y'all. I need to get my, um... My lamp out. <laughs> yeah, bro, I got it. <laughs> It'd be so funny when autocorrect changes to bro instead of Bree. Because I'll be reading stuff. I'll be like, huh? Yeah, bro. <laughs> I just laugh at it. Like, okay. Yeah, these are the more wider. They're not tape. Yeah, I just realized that I don't miss acrylic. It looked like I had these on. It's okay. It's a pop off set. But child, they they look in the hard mess. Who did I miss? Who just came in? Having a late breakfast here watching. Hey Tori. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, don't mind me. I don't know how these gonna come out. I'm just gonna be doing some. I need to be moving fast. I don't want them to spread too much. Yeah, 
Bree Wood, you highly recommend a not polished lamp. No, not necessarily. Not highly recommend. What I will say that I've noticed at first. Um, what am I about to say? Um, it does kind of die quick. But what the rep have told me, because I emailed them, not emailed them, text them on IG. They said charges for six to eight hours. Six to eight hours, which I thought was absurd. That's a long time to be charging a device, especially for that long. But I did notice that it's it's working correctly now. So I think it wasn't the battery, it was just that um I wasn't charging it long enough. I think I was only charging mine for like three or four hours. Bria, I love your left hand. Y'all heard me singing. Wait, what was I singing? What was I singing? Wait, I'm seeing Alicia Keys, was I? I don't even know y'all heard it. I'm gonna be too close to the what's the name if y'all can hear that. Oh, let me show y'all because I know y'all just came in. Hold on. My hand a little crusty because I just got through shaping the filing, but here they go. They said Karomi. Hello Kitty. I really don't like Hello Kitty like that. But I wanted to use these charms. And they spin, y'all. They spin. Yeah. Not too much because I kind of glued them shut. Like, I put a lot of glue so they won't pop off. But this is how they looking, y'all. This is my favorite nail right here. Period. Karomi. Y'all know I love a purple. Jonah Bruce said that lamp died fast. Yeah, it dies fast. But only I think it was because I had a bad battery. Or it's probably because I wasn't charging it to its full potential. I was only charging it for three hours max, but the um rep told me six to eight hours, which is a lot. But to be honest, don't spend two hundred, three hundred dollars on a lamp, y'all. The ones that's on Amazon were just as best as these right here. And let me tell you, I have seen like if you go like on Alibaba or it's it's like AliExpress, you can basically find people's vendors. For these lamps it's literally kind of the same thing all you have to do is match the descriptions of what they um say they lamp is how many watts and and all that good stuff match it with the vendors that's on aliexpress alibaba whoever it is look at it if it match up right they probably got that's the probably the vendor that they have so i ain't trying to knock nobody or anything but it's just tea yeah and i caught this on sale so i didn't play I did not pay play. I didn't pay how much is it? I think it's retailed at two fifty or something like that. It might be more than that. I got it on sale. I was lucky. So I didn't pay full price. Yeah. I only got this lamp because it was white. And I've not seen a lot of pretty white lamps that I want. And plus, I wanted to treat. I think I got this for my birthday, right? Did I get this? No, or did I get this? Stuff? I think this I got this for a Christmas present as for myself. Every now and then, I'll spoil myself, y'all. I do splurge a little bit. Um, I think last year, like for for like for Christmas or something, I did like a. I spent six hundred dollars in one day. Just on nail products alone. It really opened my eyes, and, and I was like, yeah, I need to stop. Because $600? And for what? And not a lot of it was acrylics that I barely even used for real. Wasting money. Right, 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 right. The math ain't math. What I say? Hold up. Oh yeah, most definitely. What crossover? Oh, you talking about? I forgot who started the 
the stripper finger flex, but I remember somebody. Was it Marcy that started it? Who was it? I know it's always sold out, but I got my eyes on another one. Child, it's up to me. Don't get it. Don't get it. Yeah. It, it kind of like like tie dye, but I often do all the nails like this in different colors. I like it. You know, I'm just experimenting, doing different things. You know, I try not to do everything that everyone else is doing. Are y'all talking about like this? Is that what y'all talking about? Me crossing my finger like that. I can do a lot of crazy things on my fingers. Not like that, though. Y'all dirty-minded people. No, that she that's what she calls it because she saw me doing it. I don't think I ever saw her do it before, but that's what she called it. People used to make fun of me. Like, why did y'all used to make fun of me for being able to do that? I know one thing I be laughing at is the songs that these people be making. I don't know how they be coming up with the craziness. Oh, y'all feel left out. <laughs> Anybody tell y'all to grow, grow up in age and y'all can't barely work them little fingers y'all got now? I think I should do charms on top of this when they get when I get through. But right now, they come out okay. They're not looking the best. But that's that's the good thing about it. We being ourselves. We ain't gotta worry about nobody saying we copying them or they basically did the same set. Y'all know y'all got that carpet on them. Don't play. Y'all know y'all got that copper tone. Y'all know them little fingers are old. I actually don't have any more dangle charms. I actually don't own none. Only the one that's on my thumb. I had this a very long time and I didn't buy it. I had it in my brand ambassador package. A long time ago. Well, make sure y'all wipe your sides because you don't want to lose your shape. Wait. Wait till you hit your forties, Bree. <laughs> well, I got 20 years for that, Marcy. 20 years. How old would y'all be? Mm. Y'all definitely won't be on here doing no niggas. Not at no 80. Well, no, nah, y'all won't be no 80. How old would y'all be? Y'all be like 60. Some of y'all probably like 75. Y'all definitely be some old ladies. Right now, y'all just middle age. 
can barely make it. <laughs> hey, Drea. Yes, it's three days in a row, y'all. Three days in a row. I might come on tomorrow. I like going live. But I'll be on early tomorrow because that's a Thursday. Usually on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Those are my later days. Today was a later day. I got on at like 11 something. <laughs> One thing I'm mad about is the application part. I didn't do a good job. Well, I overfiled. That's what I did. Overfiled on the cuticle error, but it's okay. What time? How early would I be going? Depend on what time. Really, it depends on what time I get up. Maybe eight, nine, my time. Probably ten. I've been going live too much, yo. And for everyone that missed it, like the application wise, these duck tips Amazon don't recommend, so don't ask where they're from. Um, I use Dream Nail Supply Pearl for these, and yeah, that's it, that's all. Hold up, I missed the first, and I thought I was showing it before I hopped on. Nope, they know. We be pushing that sun up and out the way when she go live. Oh, yeah. Today I came on a little later because I had to go to the post office, to the library. Um, that do a lot of stuff. And also, I had to go and get another box for the giveaway. It's already, like, the giveaway is already packed up, sealed box all i gotta do is write the um congratulation card to whoever it is and seal it up and ship it off so yeah y'all already know i'm always using dream nails but i'm telling y'all i'm really let me tell you what i'm thinking about is really selling all the old acrylics that i got because if drea continues to come out with cut cover acrylics that match that color matches with the brands i already have that i enjoy using it's over for them. Like, dead serious? I'm not using it no more. I'm dead serious about this. I'll literally sell the acrylics I have. Like, she's coming out with pinky news, y'all. I think it's April 20-something. Like, probably in two weeks. Let me show y'all some. Hold on. I be having acrylics that's, like, filled up to the brim. Hold on. That be filled up to the brim four ounces i'll just give it to y'all for like 20 bucks or even 15 because they they are used but they're four ounces they're two ounces like they're barely used but they've been used so i'll sell it to you for half the price i'm just being honest like i can't just give them away because these products ain't cheap baby the money I'm making reselling, I just spend it right back on Dream Nail Supply. I ain't playing to but the clock it. People can hate and say what they want about certain people, but no, no, you can't really say nothing too bad about her business at all unless you just don't know how to work with the product. Yeah, I'm over here just messing these nails up, but they're gonna come out cute. It's literally, I'm just doing like some marble tie-dye, some weird, just doing weird nails. What brand I'm talking about? What you talking about, Willis? Bruh. <laughs> I'm just talking about brands in general that I have. Like, I bought a lot. And some of these I've only swatched. Y'all know I only use like three or four brands. I'm not scared to say nobody brand. I'm talking about. A76, she only sells two ounce. Um, I got a lot of bomb nails. 
Um, it really for me base is really off a of price point too. If I can find somebody who said do do the same color for a cheaper price point and the quality is still the same or even better, I'm gonna shop where it's cheaper. And Drea literally is like we dang near sister states, baby. She right next door, so the shipping gonna be hold on. The shipping gonna be like next day. Why would I pay like twenty dollars, ten dollars? For some shipping when I can spend it and get it the next day. Like some people be thinking, oh, I'm overhyping it, but girl, I ain't no brand ambassador. I can talk about whoever I want to. And even if I was a brand ambassador, I ain't finna lie about no products. Just to make a quick book. Like I'm a brand ambassador for ASM6. She does pay her BAs, but I don't promote her anything. Like when I use a product, yeah, I'll tell you my code, but I'm not a diehard, oh yeah. You just use that. Mm-mm. If I like a product better than somebody else, I'm going to tell y'all. Nothing wrong with the, the two brands I mentioned. They got some good quality products, but the price point, I wouldn't be paying that when I can get it cheaper and quicker. Actually, to think about it, A76 is literally in Georgia. So I can literally travel up there to the shop and do pickup or something like that. Y'all, I'm over here taking too long. Look at this. Why y'all didn't tell me they was slime? Y'all too busy in these comments when y'all need to be telling me I'm doing something wrong. Night nice shift ain't no joke. You see your life away. True, I bought her powder and got them in three days from a weekend purchase. Let me tell you, she be shipping it. I order what I it's been a minute since I ordered only because I don't need nothing new right now. But let me tell you, that one time I bought Baby, a couple hours later, it said your package had been um something shipped or whatever, and sent me the tracking on. It was like two or three hours later. I was like, huh? I got my package in two, not even two days. Yeah, it was two days. It was two days. I'll say two days. It wasn't three. It was two days. A day and a half. That UPS, USPS drive was pushing that little wheel when they came to deliver my package. Mm-hmm. They was not playing no jokes. Yeah, y'all wasn't paying no attention. The, the the jail just running. Look at look at the table. Jail everywhere. Y'all gotta keep me in line because I be running my mouth. But I don't care. As long as y'all keep me on, I, I don't mind talking. Now that I'm looking at it, I think this pinky nail kind of ugly, but it's giving those little tie-dye shirts. Y'all know them tie-dye tie Oh, I know what I can do. Y'all know once I get through put taco, I can do like bling here, bling here, bling here, bling here, bling here. Like little, um, like some SX6 or 4s. I don't know nothing about no size, but I know the small ones. Just place them randomly, probably like three to four on each nail. Yeah, definitely summer i'm ready like i'm ready for the colors and i know you coming out with a summer collection don't play just say yes just say yes in the comments if you are because i feel like you are i'm ready i'm ready mm -hmm. yep just say yes if you, you coming out with a summer collection mm -hmm. just say yes just say yes i'm like just say yes Okay. See, yeah. Okay, I knew it. Mm-hmm. Oh, I be knowing. I be knowing. I be knowing before you know what you finna do. Mm-hmm. Exactly, y'all. Let me, y'all, last, let me get on y'all for a second. The people that was in jail live naming no acrylics, y'all count y'all days. I left to go run some errands and completely forgot. Completely forgot. Completely forgot she was online. I came in and I left and forgot about it. Y'all count y'all days. Everybody that was in that live just... She even told y'all to come get me. Like, what? what? Y'all better stand on that. 
because let me go. I'm gonna make sure I write some names. I'm gonna be ready with my pen and paper. Just give me a couple colors that's gonna be. I know it's gonna be a blue or pink. Just wait. I'm gonna be ready. Cause y'all did me dirty. Mm mm. I'll never forget y'all. I'll never forgive y'all for that. Now one day I did like I forgot what the one Jen name. I like the one Jen name. Um. If somebody put it, I'll be able to um, say it for y'all. Oh, Jonah, you want that? Okay, see, Jonah, I like you now. I like you more than... Jonah, my favorite. Oh, Kira, I, I know you was there because I watched the replay. You named the third one, I think. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. But I haven't... Enough. Ooh, don't say it here. You got to say it in your life. Because I'm... Uh-uh. Ooh, yeah, she got to announce me. I feel like I know what it is. Ooh, I know what it is. I'm not gonna say nothing. Cause I be I be too loud and I get it right. Bri ain't never got nothing wrong. Mm -mm. It's me talking to third person. See y'all think y'all slick. Y'all get me talking here on this live and I'm been it's been an hour now, but wait, why it have to be here? What's funny? Hold up. We could not find you. No, ain't nobody misses me. Ain't Ain't nobody message nothing. Y'all don't deserve to know. No, y'all don't deserve to know. Don't say it, Drea. Not yet. Not yet. Whisper it in my ear. Just whisper it in my ear first before you tell them. Just send me a quick little message on Instagram real quick. Andromeda? It looks like Andromeda. That's spelled correctly. It looks like Andromeda. Y'all ever seen? Y'all probably don't know anything about that show. I don't even know the name of the show. I don't know the name of the show. But it's a girl on the show called Andromeda. Y'all too, y'all too old to be knowing what the show called. Okay, hold on. I'm waiting on the message to pop up right now. Let me get my phone out. Hold up. Cause they don't need to know. Mm hmm. This ain't even no green. What the hell am I doing? What y'all laughing for? I'm so serious. Y'all don't need to know. I chat with y'all later. I feel like I'm left out. Bye. Hold up, hold up. What did it say? Hold on. Let me read. <gasps> no way. Hold up. <gasps> what? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, my goodness, y'all. She finna make me cry on the hold on. Mm -mm. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, what? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wait, oh my goodness, y'all. Oh my goodness. Hold on. What? I'll chat with y'all later. I feel like I'm left out. Bye. Girl, I almost said something. You almost ruined the mood. Because what? Marcy, why you so loud? Oh my goodness. Marcy, you so loud. I'm confused. Hold on. Before. Yeah. Hold up. She, girl, you wasn't even saying nothing the entire live unless I missed your comments, which I didn't because I know how to read and articulate pretty darn well. What are you talking about?
anyways, goodbye. Have a nice day. Because why is buy all in cows? Hey, bitch, move around. Find you something to do. You really just changed my mood in two seconds. I just really got some good news and that's that. How y'all block somebody on your, cha on your channel? How do y'all block somebody on your channel? Because I don't want her, uh-uh. She really just... Because what are you talking about? How you feel left out if you're not even commenting? It's not our fault you don't support or watch Drea. I need mods. Yeah, I'm going to get some on y'all. Hold on, y'all. Because what? I'm confused. Y'all, the one thing, yesterday live, I ignore her. Because, of course, why not? But, girl, don't start with me. Because what's funny, I said it in my live yesterday, but I didn't too much go into detail. Yeah, hold on, y'all. I'm going to get to that. I'm going to get to that. It's a girl on here. She left. She probably gone now because she ain't coming to no more. But yesterday in my live, somebody had joined in. But what was funny, on Instagram, she was talking crap about me, about one of my nail sets I did. And, um, what am I talking about? Yo. And then... I said, I responded back, you know, ha ha he he, because I thought it was real funny. You a fan. And then she blocked me. And then yesterday when I seen her reappear in my life, this happened a couple months ago, what I just said, but yesterday she reappeared, reappeared in my life. And then I was like, hmm, okay, let's go to IG and see if I'm still blocked. I'm unblocked. You being messy for what? She was not, exactly, why she felt left out? She wasn't chatting. She stopped chatting for a while. I guess because we started talking about Drea and her live or whatever. And she felt like it was a problem. But anyways, y'all, anyways, hmm. Anyways, anyways, hmm. What am I looking for? Hold on. Let me show y'all the inspo that I'm doing right now. Because I forgot to show y'all. We're going for something like this. Y'all don't worry about her. We done with it. Anyways. Anyways, we ain't worrying about her. Mm -mm. Guess what the news I just found out, y'all? Because what? Marcy, you was right. Anyways. Anyways, motherfucker, old days, attitude stink, but my, okay, come on, y'all, let's get back to the inspo, it ain't really the inspo, but it's the inspo, because I felt like, yeah, was I the only one that saw the mood change when that comment popped up, because what, I don't leave nobody out at all, let's be honest, I read every single comment, I'm responding, she was the first person here on the beginning of live. I was interacting. All that good stuff. Thank you. Hmm. Tell y'all something. Y'all just crazy. Don't come here with the BS. Because what? But anyway, somebody DM me and tell me how to block somebody on your channel. Real quick. Just tell me how to block somebody. Just tell me how to block somebody here. She pregnant? Who pregnant? Not me. Not yet. Not again. What? All right, hold on. Ooh, not that. Ooh, wrong thing. 
Can't let y'all see my messages. Ooh. All right, hold on, y'all. Where I go? My life? How do I get there? Kira Brady? Wait, what? Who prayed? Who's expecting a child? What do y'all say? How, how, well, I don't see nothing about no blog. What is, where is it? How I use on channel, put in timeout, remove a part pin, go to channel. How do y'all do this? Y'all, wait, what? I didn't talk, I talked on her comment. Is that right? Well, it don't matter. We can kill people with kindness real quick. I don't, I don't even care. Because, well, it's looking like the AKs over here. Okay. Hold on, y'all. What y'all talking about? Mm -hmm. It's okay. I gotta go about blocking nobody. Because I can easily ignore people. I just act like I don't see them. That's what I was doing yesterday, like. Yeah, I responded a couple questions. But that was it. Because yesterday y'all missed it. Um, She made a comment saying, though nail something, they too long or something out of the out of the blue. It was just weird. I don't care. I don't care nothing about that. Like, what? I don't care nothing about that. Because one thing I'm not going to do is drama. You can get kick rocks, man. Let me tell you, the two ladies that was beefing back and forth, y'all probably know. Um, YouTube a couple weeks ago, whatever it was, two weeks ago last week, I unsubscribed. I ain't got time for y'all. Y'all too old for this. Why y'all 45, 55, 65, however old you is? Beefing. This ain't high school. I don't even play about stuff like that. I never did. I was never in no drama. That's why I don't have friends now, because women in general... Be acting like little kids. I'm 20 and I act better than y'all at y'all big age. Y'all better chill out. Yeah, I probably know who we talking about, but those two, it might have been three people going back and forth. Who thought Dre was pregnant? Why would Dre tell me she pregnant, y'all? She would have just literally told everybody that was the case. What makes me so special? I'm not pregnant either, y'all. Oh, I wasn't talking. Not, not, not Cindy. I'm talking about these two older ladies. They, they older.
Y'all know. Hold up, my phone going off. Who this? Y'all being messy on IG. Let me see some. Y'all get blocked too. Wait, what? Y'all see this? Okay. Ain't no boy y'all still on this pregnant. Who ain't nobody pregnant, y'all? Don't wish that on nobody just yet. Let me tell y'all, if y'all not financially ready to take care of no kid, don't have them. Okay? That's the bottom line. Ain't nothing wrong with giving them up for adoption now. If you really seriously can't financially take care of a child, please don't have them. Or don't do the things that make you have them. You know, some people are unfortunate and things happen. But yeah, do what you got to do. Because I'll be hating to see when people go through a lot of things just to um, be able to support their child. Y'all know what's funny? She probably didn't mean no harm. And I just started going off because what? Cause I just get a feeling. I got this feeling inside my bones. It goes electric, baby, when you turn it on. Y'all know that song? I got that sunshine in my body. I don't even know it, y'all. I don't. I don't think. I think. I don't think she mean no harm by that, y'all. So she, if she was, she come back and she watching this. Sorry, girl, if I read it wrong, but it felt like you was trying to be shady, cause all the what you had, what she commented. When she commented, why was the buy in all caps and the rest of the stuff wasn't? So you purposely had to cap, uh, cap, put cap lock on, and comment that. So I felt, you know, I felt a little something. She probably ain't mean no harm. So she watching this, sorry. Not sorry, but it is what it is. I just had a little feeling. Maybe she did mean no harm, y'all. And I just went off. Cause it threw me it threw me off. Oh, you threw me off. I didn't have room. Like I said, y'all, I had a feeling at first. And then it goes back to previous encounter with her. That you know made me react that way real quick with that comment. So if y'all say I ain't overreacting, okay, but still I do be feeling bad when I when I do misinterpret some stuff. Cause sometimes people typing all caps, but the way she, the way she went about it, her initial message was not in caps, but the by B Y E was in caps, which is like I was like, hold up, I feel it. I feel it. You know, hit dog gonna haul and don't play. But also, these are nothing but text messages. Like, we can interpret things very, very different. But I don't be caring. But then again. I ain't with that mess. I don't care about none of that. Baby, I just got a deal of a lifetime right here. And I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a support regardless, even if I wasn't. Let me tell y'all. 
this just happened today. Anything previously that I've said is still the same in mother the old days. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Cause a lot of people be like, Oh my god, she's a brand ambassador, she get things for free or whatever is a discounted rate, whatever the case may be. I've been supporting Drea. So Y'all know what it is and what it's not. Let me tell you, just because this goes for all across everything. I, I, I'm not lying about nothing. Even if I have a problem or whatever, I'm still going to stay true to me and what I like to use. And right now, Dream Nail Supplies on top. Everybody else, I use once in a blue moon. Yesterday, I didn't use no Dream Nail Supply. All I used was her clear. That's it. Cause period. And if I don't like some, of course, I'm going to let it be known that it's not for me, but it might be for you. Anything I recommend is for me 100%. I don't play those games. Just like some of y'all favorite brands like Not Polish, Kiara Sky. Um, who, who else is big? I don't care for those brands. They're not bad. Young Nails, I don't care for those brands. I don't care. I don't care nothing about those brands. They're good brands. I prefer not to use them. Y'all know what I'm saying? Nothing wrong. I have a personal purpose for what I like to use. And percent wise, Dre is 100%. I've never ran into anything that was bad from everything that I purchased and also the things that was gifted to me. Thank y'all. I did show the inspo, but I'm not really going off the inspo. It's just something like the color palette is what I'm using, but actually doing it? No, I'm not doing that. Y'all got to be talking around my mouth. We finna be hitting the two hour mark. How did I miss this? Wait, what? Hold on. I need to stop talking. Because what are you already doing? And one thing about me. If I was a business owner, I wouldn't be. If I see somebody that's a mess, mm -mm. no ma'am. Yes, Miss Gina. I'll catch you. I'm going to be the Literally, if I see you hop on right now, I'm going to use my phone to get on. I don't care what I'm doing. I always going to stop and watch the people I love to enjoy, enjoy watching. Remember, yesterday I was on live. I think Drea dropped the video. I was literally watching her video while I on live. That's why I be so quiet. I don't be caring about none of that. I'll put, I'll put y'all first before I put myself first. I'm always supporting Yeah, y'all. Like I said, I do apologize for the outburst. But it's just... And if it was taken the wrong way, that's okay. Oh, that's why I went on polish. Y'all keep wiping it off. Yeah, y'all. I'm about to get ready, get ready to get off. So, really, once I get off here, make sure y'all go straight off of this or before and go support Miss Jeannie. Because uh, why not? Because why not? I really shouldn't have this on top of this because the radiation from the lamp and this iPad should not be sitting on top of each other.
Just remember what comes up, comes up. Maybe Just remember what comes up, comes up. Yeah, I'll try to come on tomorrow, y'all. But I really think she didn't mean no harm, though. <laughs> but <laughs> the damage had been done. I don't talk my stuff. And let me tell y'all, I ain't afraid to admit when I'm in the wrong about anything. I'm a big girl. I know how to right my wrongs. Whatever Bryson Tiller said. Alright, okay. I'm almost done, y'all. I'm finna get off. But it's funny. <laughs> yeah, y'all, I think I messed it up when I seen that. Because I was really about to cry until I seen that comment. I was I could hardly breathe. Like my back big, but that was a different type of barely can breathe. I do appreciate Jay and I, and I was truly surprised. I wasn't even thinking. She, like I watched her video that day. Anybody know who watches her channel? She was talking about it probably two two videos back about a brand new so I think I thought she was gonna be talking about um like somebody like Momo or Jen or somebody, not me. I was, you know, with me, I'm, I don't expect those things to happen to me. But good thing comes to those who wait. I, I, I promise y'all, God is always good, and He's gonna forever um bless you with anything that you need. Not everything that you want. Let Him guide you through everything. I'm telling y'all. But you gotta be mindful. You can't expect to get something and not put the work in. So if you're not constantly prayed up and being mindful of the things that you do, like I just did right there, like although I probably was mistaken, but y'all say I wasn't, I'm just saying, I know how to own up to my wrongs and my rights or whatever, how you say it. But let me tell you, I am not afraid to speak my mind and I am open as a book. I'm not the, the most perfect person, but let me tell y'all, I open that Bible up real quick and I'll read you what it says before I judge anybody and what they do. I am not the best at everything, but I'm always looking to better myself as a woman of God and as a human being who does make mistakes. You know, a lot of people don't believe the same thing I believe, that's your that's that's you. Can't report force nothing on nobody. I remember an encounter where a girl was like, you reading a Bible verse is unnecessary. This is my channel and I will do as I please. Every time you open my channel, every time you um look at my description about the first thing you're gonna see before you see like, come and subscribe is a Bible verse and it's gonna forever be a Bible verse. Because one day just one day somebody could be having a bad day you open up youtube you click on my video you see that bible verse it might just hit you the needle right on the head whatever it's called how that saying go you know what i'm saying i don't try to force nothing on them but let me tell you 
I'll preach it when I need to preach it. And that's on that. I'm not the best. I still do things that's not look good upon. But I'm working on it. And one thing I do need to work on is cursing. Y'all hear it once in a while if I'm really, really ticked off about something. But no. But guess what? Anyways, look who I got. I was going to use this, but mm-mm. Yes, ma'am. This liquid gold, period. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Y'all ain't got this. Do y'all got this? I don't think so. I was the first to technically have this. Besides um, her brand ambassador, Crystal. I think she was the very first. But I was the first one on her website purchasing. Mm-hmm. And I got me some of this. I like to... Y'all, let me tell y'all. I ain't gonna never lie about something I like just for some views and clicks and make a purchase. I don't play. Like, let me tell y'all a little story. Everybody, well, not everybody. Most of y'all probably know if y'all like been watching me a long time. This brand right here, I used to be a brand ambassador for. But one thing I couldn't find myself like I felt like I was kind of lying. Well, it wasn't really lying because I like the products 80% of the time, not 100%. So when I was doing my videos a while back, I was like, dang, it really felt like I wasn't 100% telling the truth about the product. Because certain things, I only liked her glitter for real, for real. I didn't like the consistency of the acrylics because um, they wasn't pairing good with that Eno Couture Monoma. But a lot of people like her product, support the products. You know, everybody had their own opinion. But I was like, you know what? I don't think she's a great fit for me. Because if I'm not 100%, 101% down for her, I, I'm, I, I'm not recommending it no more. So, like, a couple months back, I decided to be like, nope. I let it go. That was it. And so now when y'all see me talk about brands, talk about the things that I love to use, it's 100% hands down. So, whenever you see me be like, oh, I don't use this. Why do I don't use this brand? Because I 100% don't care for or don't necessarily use it. Like, um, I've tried a lot of brands. Um, a lot of um, I got a comment in one of my videos before. Why don't I use not polish? Why don't I use Kier Style? Why don't like why haven't I tried um Chisel? Or why haven't I tried all these brands? One thing about me, if I find something that I truly, truly hands down love. I'm not finna spend my money. Let me tell y'all something. If y'all was to look at my bank statements and see all the money I've been spending on products like bomb nails, shops are so cute. Um, let me see. A76. It's some other brands here. Hold on. Let me show y'all. Because I got plenty. I got plenty to show. Um, who's this? House of Supplies. Who else I got? I got plenty of brands that I got. B glitters. I got so many. I ain't scared to buy no products. I go out and take a risk, but still, money be spent. And sometimes I be SOL. That means out of luck. If you know, you know. So, this day and age where I'm starting to pay for a lot of more things and be become more of an adult and transition over from being under your parents wing you'll notice the amount of money you're spending so i was like it's time out for me um plan and buying different kind of things so i'm only set on buying products i'm gonna use almost every day so like i said drea is having a new drop coming with a lot of stuff and i noticed she's coming out with pink cover colors and one thing about me your girl gonna make some custom colors she gonna make some custom colors because one thing I'm not finna do is overpay something. Overpay something that I can make myself. I'm not playing. Hold on, I was getting her move from. Her move is that that pink one? I want that one. I think her move is that pink one. I want that one. I love to see how I'm gonna use one when I order cover colors. I'm just waiting to see. Yeah, I'm waiting to. Don't scroll down the community tab and you will see. Came back and he's. YouTube, curse me, I've been there, especially after hearing about the man, that was, yeah, that was crazy, oh, yeah, 
I don't even remember what I was talking about, but I was talking about the products, I think. But seriously, y'all, I've tried brands. I just don't prefer to use them. Ain't nothing wrong with them. But if I'm not 100% with it, I'm just not. Like, a lot of people think, oh, okay, we got time to do this. Just go and get your life right, right now. Just go and get it right now. Because nobody really knows when he's coming back. But you do have a certain timeline. If you think about it, when you read, I know I'm getting biblical. If you if you don't care to listen, this exit out. But in the book of Revelation, it's a certain amount of things that have to be done before he come back. So, yes, a lot of things that are in there are happening now. You know, some people be like, oh, y'all just so, um, what's it called? What's the word? Not hypothetical. What is the word? Not theoretical. It's a word that I'm thinking about. Com uh, conspiracy theorists or whatever. It's a word or whatever. Some people like, y'all overreacting, this and that. But no, y'all better start playing. Stop playing for real. And it's really on the younger generation who think it's a game. But when the time happens and it's our judgment day, it's over for everybody. It really is. And you can't feel sorry for those. It's literally, I can't I can't remember the man name in the Bible. I can't remember. I have to look it up. It's a man who actually went to hell. I don't, I don't think it, it wasn't Lazarus. Not Lazarus. It was somebody went to hell. And he tried to tell he was begging God to um to um tell us or tell the people during that time about hell is real. God said no. They already know. They got the word. They got the Bible. They can see for themselves. So you don't believe? You don't live your life as him through you? You don't go to know. And one thing I hate, like I don't hate it. That's a bad word. I don't like use it, but a lot of people, like myself, I consider myself basically lukewarm. And being lukewarm, you'll still be going to hell, whatever the case may be. But a lot of people be like, oh, God know my heart. God know my heart. Baby, when the time comes, he going to know your soul. You're going to be sent where everybody else at. I'm just being honest. I'm just being honest. I'm looking for something and I can't think about it because I'm running my mouth. Yeah. Especially, I'm telling y'all, the, the, the people out this generation, like right now, the younger kids, they think it's a game. Oh, they want to live their life as is. You only get one, you only get one. Okay, you keep thinking that. Because there's no way we just magically appeared on Earth out of the blue. There's no way. Y'all know what's crazy? That same phrase that everybody talks about in the Bible that's repeated over 365 times. Do not be afraid. You can't tell me that it's not true. That it's magically a book. That's the oldest book around that is most known. It's literally speaking facts to us about events that have not happened yet. Things that, that something that's been written down for thousands of years ago are being fulfilled. Like, girl, I'm boy, whoever. You better give it a program. You know, one thing I hate about the schooling system is the things that they teach you. Y'all know how one thing I hated was being forced to learn about the different gods with the Lord G. I hated that because during them tests that I had to take, I was not good at taking them. Whatever, whoever they are, I can't remember. Y'all know. I can't even recall them the name. Was it Lazarus? Okay, I was right. I, I just didn't know. Cause I don't like to be loud and then be wrong. Y'all know what I'm saying? So there are a lot of people that basically claim, oh, they perfect or whatever. I don't like people that basically 
shame people for the way they live, but you're living a two two way um lifestyle. Um, that's one creator here on YouTube. Everybody probably know. I've been in a couple, you know, dealings. Certain things that that person have said that I was like, uh, okay. Please don't try to be a hypocrite. Because you're teaching about something, but you're basically doing the opposite or whatever. You know. Yeah, the evolution that Big Bang, all that to me is crap. I don't give a what nobody say. I hated that I had to learn that in school, especially when, you know, growing up, I wasn't taught no, no, nothing about no Bible. I didn't go to church or whatever. So it's kind of hard when you have to grow up like that. Later in your life, you have to start learning and reading about it. Things like that. I never liked the way that they teach. They do the schooling and teaching and stuff like that. And they took it. All the thing I remember in school, like seventh, eighth grade, that pertain to the actual Bible is when they te they teach you about Abel, Abel, Cain and Abel. I think that's them two, Adam and Eve's son. Like the main, the main two. That's the only thing you learn. Um, in school, they taking a lot of um biblical stuff out of school teaching. It was called more different. They're basically teaching you how to, you know, make money and get a decent paying job. Hopefully, they're not teaching you about the true way to live your life while you're here. Here, I'm definitely have to check that out. You said it's on your community tab. Oh yeah, but let me tell you, I come from a school that if y'all don't know, I know y'all got it, it's a, like, you know, I'm black, so we're basically more like the school we come to, um, like around here, some of them, not all of them, you, of course you got your, you know, I don't want to call it, I don't want to miss say the wrong word, but it is what it is, like you have your white school you know, more so people who got money type of schools. Then you got your, I won't say poor, but, you know, I guess middle class or whatever. Basically, they basically say all black people poor. That's the type of thing they be saying, you know, how they word it. But that is definitely not true. Oh, what am I talking about? Yeah, and it's really sad because they always characterize blacks, Hispanics, Latinos, um, whatever, high really anybody that's not like pale, palm colored, as poor or whatever. But the most successful people in the world are black, anyways. Besides, um, what's that? What's that mean? Um, Zach Efron, whoever, whoever the heck that is. I forgot what he do, whatever. I'm not too invested in anything. Because one thing about me, I don't care about what y'all say. Ain't no celebrity. Ain't none of that. We all people. We all equal. We all equal. We are all equal. Here's what the thumb looking like, y'all. I think the thumb is the best nail, really. Like, ooh. I think I should have used more pink anything but y'all got me on here today preaching and stuff
Y'all, please excuse, because I'll be forgetting that I'm on live and not here by myself just singing. I can't sing for nothing, so don't be coming over here and laughing at me. Don't come over here laughing at me, okay? I was just a little old girl. And I got a deep voice too. So when I sing or attempt to sing, it's horrible. <laughs> it is horrible. And I don't be caring though. Am I really silly? I don't even be trying to be silly, y'all. It's just me. This is me. I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be now. Gonna live the light. Shut up, me. There's no way to hold me. Anybody watch Can't Rock before? I think Can't Rock was made before I was born, so y'all probably seen it. Yeah, I think the bling gonna make it pop. Cause I did kind of I forgot, I was gonna go in and add some white. Just added some Wait, what? All right. <laughs> Riley for Pierre Riley. Anybody that knew nails, be like, yep, my mom do nails. Mm -hmm. Our favorite girl, period. Our favorite girl, period. Dre be trying to make her seem bad, but Bronnie, she just misunderstood, y'all. She just misunderstood. But that live, though, I was watching it back. She kept grabbing everything, everything. Which was fun. My niece like that, too. She, it really be the girls. The boys be real chill when they younger. The girls, that's what you got to watch out for. My niece, she be thinking she's slick. You two years old, and you acting like you got name 25. And then she be she be having she be saying smart stuff. Like she thinks she's sleep. She can talk plain as day. But when she's when it's time for you to be like, oh, what you said? What was that? Remember I want to hear that Google Gaga guy guy or that babble and stuff? What, what you talking about? You know how to talk. Cause like girl, what? You don't deserve my love. You brought me through the Y'all, I hate this because my bling is stuck together. Because I had got some, um, what you call it? What is it called? Um, that my cart gel. And I accidentally had my current mount right there. And it just threw it off. Oh, you threw me off. She's a three. I'm a teen. Mm -hmm. Boy, you don't deserve. You pushed him But then you blew up. What kind of 
Tommy you made, PJ. What you said? I'm over here singing and stuff. What I miss? Because I don't want nobody to feel left out. Left out by little old me. I was just only 20. I was just fresh out of college. I just heard people's feelings every now and then. Mm -mm, I feel left out like Cindy. What you said? Nothing. You ain't leaving no one out. See, one thing about me, I can joke about stuff because it's in the past now. <clears throat> I ain't hating about it. PJ, what you, what you said? Let me scroll up. Let me, hold on. Let me see something. Did you say something I missed? Because I know I did Oh, Chris, I don't miss your comment. Yeah, I love Camera Raw. Disney was my favorite channel. Oh, yeah. Hold on, hold on. I think I found it. Breeze or something. Let me see. I'm sure you remember. You're right. We all can go. That blame ain't going to say it all. Y'all right. She, she think everybody who do nails to that kid that was a little inside Joe. She's skinny girl. What did you say? I still miss it. Am I slow? But oh. <laughs> wait, what? I did. Did you delete that? Cause I think I did see that. Why am I talking so loud? Sorry, y'all. Sorry. Oh, <laughs> yeah, she is in the town. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> am I black? Well, I don't know. You tell me. Am I? I think I'm. I think I'm. I don't know. What am I? I don't know. What am I, y'all? What am I? At least I'm not pale. At least I'm not pale. I hope y'all can't hear this in the background. Can y'all hear this TV? It's over here on playing Scooby Doo. I was I've been watching this for the past day and a half. <clears throat> it's like one of my comfort shows. Like if I can't find that on Netflix or anything to watch, that's definitely what I'm gonna be watching. Anyways, y'all, I'm done. I just got the cuticle oil on. But one thing I want to say is God looking out for me. I am so I am so happy and blessed. I would say I'm highly favored, but I'm blessed. Sorry, y'all. I think I was froze. My phone showed 20%, but we, we done anyways, so it don't even matter. Can y'all see me? Am I clear? Am I back? Can y'all see? Sorry. Am I fixed now, y'all? Okay, y'all can see me. Okay. My phone was saying 20% with my other. But... Yes. Chocolate. Chocolate sounds so good. What are you? Chocolate? <laughs> Y'all seen that episode of Spongebob? Chocolate! He was going down. Hey, y'all. I like to put cuticle oil when I get done underneath my nails, too. But this is pop-up, so I don't care. 
Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I'm yellow. Well, at least you're not red or orange. Yeah. At least you're not orange. I would hate to be born orange. But let me tell you. I enjoy myself. I enjoy myself today. I had a good laugh. This is probably the fun, the best live I don't been on. Well, hosted, not been on. I don't been on some. So what am I doing with a swatch stick? Hold on. I'm looking for some. Hold on. I'm gonna show y'all. I'm actually not even. Well, what am I thinking about? Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, it's one fifteen. Y'all literally had me on this thing talking for two whole hours straight, almost an hour straight without doing nothing for real, for real. Cause there's literally no way I've been on this live this long. So yesterday live, yeah, I was on for fifty minutes. And that nail set was 3XL, I think. Believe it or not, I used to be yellow too, Kier. I used to be yellow. If you was to look at my baby pictures, not like baby, baby pictures, but one or two, three years old, <clears throat> I was a light bright. That's what my daddy called him. Like people that's real light skin, he call them light brights, or he'll call you a little white girl, which is funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll probably come on tomorrow, y'all. That's if I get up. Because I'll be taking, sometimes I'll be taking late night naps or whatever. Well, I sleep during the day and I'll be up at night. Um, I'll be up. I feel like I'm on third shift or something like that. Yeah, the favorite, my favorite nail is definitely this storm, y'all. Look at it. Hold on, before we get off. Hold on. Because my phone is on 20%. But if it dies, just die. <laughs> oh my goodness, y'all. Oh my goodness. Just imagine she watching this live back and be like, hold on. What you being messy for? <laughs> she probably like, hold up, I ain't even mean it that way. But I'm loving not the shape of this pinky, you know. But the other nails, they look flipped up. But it's okay. I don't even know how I got this dark. It's really weird because I'm darker, but my like upper body is really brown skin, but my lower, like my thighs, legs, and everything chest and down is light. Like if you was to see my legs or something, you'd probably think I was a light bright or whatever. But nope. Like right. What do what do you folks get these little turns from? I'm looking for something. What am I looking for? Oops. Got your man. No, I'm just playing y'all. Sitting on live, I forgot to text somebody back. 
Hold on, let me see something. It's two hours ago. Sorry. Oh yeah, the final file. It's still a little messed up. This nail right. I need to do better. Hold on, y'all. I'm finna get off. Y'all probably like, girl, shut the hell up and come on. This nail just towed up to the floor. Still jacked up. I don't care. Cuba on Cuba, my and left. Yeah. Not you slapping right, y'all. It still be so fun, and when I, before be going back and forth on Twitter, I'd be like, "What you being messy for?" Oh, that's cool. It be so crazy how we come out. Looking like different colors. My daddy a light bright. He darn near look like he white. My mama, she's she's dark. You know, the color everybody name mama be hating on. All colors and shades are beautiful. Period. Ain't nobody discriminating around here. You too old for that. Your grandma, your great 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 grandparents is dead. Let that mentality go. All right, y'all. Let me stop procrastinating. All right. One last thing. Let me look at something before I go. All right, y'all. This is the final. Can y'all see? This is the final look. My favorite is the pinky. One thing about me, I love it. <clears throat> but anyways, y'all, I'm finna head out. I'll probably be on tomorrow. If not, um, Friday, I got a video dropping. So, yeah, y'all stay tuned for that. Um, I will be doing a better, um, what you call it, um, appreciation video for Drea, specifically. Like, when we get everything worked out, um, you know, whatever the case may be, um, how that goes, y'all will know everything and, or whatever. <clears throat> how that goes but for the most part we started off okay we started off okay okay but that comment threw me off it's okay though it's okay but i enjoyed my time here with y'all today for real for real i'm actually getting a little sick <clears throat> i've been talking too much but for the most part we i had a little blast today we talking about some good stuff. We got a little little Bible lesson in today. All right. <clears throat> One thing about me, I enjoy talking, y'all. Sometimes. But make sure tonight, Drea will be going live. So watching her own. Um, well, she said her summer's collection. Y'all be there so we can name some of these names and get it in. Miss Genie is live right now. Let's go ahead and go support each other. And I truly had a great time, y'all. I truly had a great time. And that's it, y'all. I'm going to give y'all another close-up. And then we getting out of here because I talked too much. And probably overdid something, but... Yeah, y'all. I'm going to see y'all in my next one. Um, y'all stay blessed and have a wonderful day.
night, afternoon, wherever you are. And just enjoy. God bless and see y'all next time. Bye.